Hi, Rumians. I'm Drushnik. Thank you for being here and welcome back to another episode of the Grumi Collective in our Stellaris Federation series. Hopefully I'll be less of a noob in this episode, not just in playing Stellaris, but I discovered at the uh, end of the last episode that I had not even turned on my auto-ducking software. So step away from recording for a week or two and you have apparently forgotten everything. Apparently it's not like riding a bike, you do forget. <laughs> but in any case, let's, uh, let's hope that um, I'll be doing better for you today. And, uh, with that said, it is nearly time to attack these these dudes. I did promise it. I keep promising you things and then I don't deliver on it. Yeah, actually, I'm not sorry, but, um, <laughs> I wanted to say I'm sorry, but I'm not. But I do want to get at least one more cruiser or battleship in the poison spike, and, uh, and then we're gonna move. We are going to move. We are moving! Moving, 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 moving. Oh, man. You know what? I, I'm i very happy to be recording again, let me tell you that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Things and stuffs. <sighs> Taking care of everything. Okay, um, let's see. We will need crystals again soon, so I don't want to upgrade this hollow temple. And, but we do have a huge problem here in Orchid. We might want to resettle these people to somewhere. Oh dear, we have jobless people everywhere. If, if we can fix the situation in Lycan, they have five housing left. We might be able to do something. Or we send them to Sunlight and quickly build stuff there. Because that's the young planet. One, two, three, four. Let's do four. Sunlight now has a lot of unemployed people. But we can fix it. Let's build another city district. And quickly, quickly, quickly... What is going on here? Are we blocking stuff? We are. No. No, no. No, we're not. You have 19... You're 19 size planet. Why do you not have districts left? Planetary features. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we do need to get rid of these volcanoes. One. Because I do need... No, actually, no. You're going to have to wait. Uh, I do need something that will absorb jobs. Like, it should just slurp them up. Like that. Um, no gene clinics. I'm so scared of gene clinics right now. Chemist jobs, one. Metallurgist jobs, two. Artisan job, two. Clerk jobs, five. Five. I need five. There we go. Commercial zones. You are mine. Thank you and come here. Okay. <laughs> that will give us energy, too, actually. Those commercial zones. I did not think of that yet. Hmm. Smarty Pants. Smarty Pants. Smarty Pants is gonna do the Smarty Pants dance when this plan works out. But it has to work out first. It has to work out first. We are earning a lot of consumer goods again, so that means that we can afford to go to the market, sell, sell these things, and get stuff. That's good. And that makes me happy. And we can reinforce this fleet one more time. That's a battleship. Yes! Okay, good, 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 good. And that means I can now focus on upgrading post catnip again when I have 242 extra alloys. So that's going to have to happen. And then we're going to get rid of all these things because they annoy me. The envoy has died. We don't care. Ooh, capacity overload. Oh, we do need capacity overload. Oh, yes. Boom. We barely had enough influence for that. But otherwise, we are in huge problems. Okay. So. so here Construction we have specialists complete. without a job. Now, upgrading this uses gases. We actually have one. Boom. Let's go. Let's have Redwood, our tech planet, be as good as it can be. You're still building that battleship. We can even... What are you going to be building? Oh, a cruiser if we do this. Yeah, but hang on. Hang on. I'm gonna upgrade that. Um, let's go to the marketplace and sell 5k of these boys and then buy ourselves alloys. I don't remember if I still have a deal with the curators or if I had to give up on that. 
I should check that. Reinforce this fleet. Curators, curators. Hello. Yes, we are. Aided. Um, how long, though? Okay, 1700 days left, so that's good. I still haven't chosen those ascension perks. <laughs> Silly me. Oh, sirens outside. Um, I actually think maybe my microphone doesn't even pick that up. I should stop talking about that. <laughs> when we have 10k alloys, we can start um, fixing the ring world. That's going to be cool. Construction complete. But we need our ships in order first, and we need to get rid of the gray goo. They haven't been invading. That makes me worried. I could send in a science ship to see what's out there. No. Yes, I can. If I put it out of evasive stance, then I can. Passive. Um, but I think that we are okay. I think that if we go in and say our Hail Marys, we should be fine. I think we should be. So, let's wait for that battleship to be done. Oh, you're building a lot of ships. Huh. You're a good juggernaut. I like you. I really do like you. Okay, we have a building slot here. We might want to get a city district first, though. And what about... What about... What about... I don't know. I keep telling you. I keep, keep talking about that, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm about, okay? I don't... I don't know. I want the world. Rare crystals, that's what I want. Did I already pass up on those things? Research complete. Thank you. There you go. Okay, naval cap. We could go up in fleet command limit. That'd be good. They're fighting. Stop fighting. Who's fighting? The Erebot collectors and the Glaren. Erebot collectors? The dynastic union of Glera is embroiled in civil war, pitting the organic Glaran government against the intelligence that metastasized in their systems. Oh, <laughs> well, good luck with that. Have fun. I'm not going to come help. Research complete. I am not going to come help. Oh, energy credits, please. Yes, thank you. Let's communicate with the Shroud, hopefully get something good. Uh, so it is, and so it always will be. Let's uh, get ship repair, Boon. Yes. No, no, we didn't get it. Wow, we have bad luck with the Shroud in this game. We really have bad luck. Okay. He's finishing this battleship, then one more, and we're going in. Research complete. That's the best we can be right now, unless I build more ships, but I don't want to do that anymore. I just, I just want to, I want to get rid of this. I want to get rid of this threat. And our fleet is good. Our fleet is really good. So surely we can do this. I think we can. So. You're being upgraded. I don't have the money to upgrade you. You have been upgraded. Oh, governor died. That's bad. We need a governor. This dude is available. Let's use him. Saves me another dude. I like that. Okay, um... Yes. We are over admin cap now. When will we have another building slot? Here soon. But we could also upgrade one of those admin centers here on Elodea, for example. What do you need? Crystals. Yeah, we're building that, so that's fine. Upgrade it. Ooh, five unemployed here on New Leaf. 
That's bad. That's bad. We do have only two unemployed in sunlight, so let's make that four. Ha ha! Da 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 da! We can build something again. And then. Another synthetic crystal plant, please. It'll take a while to get there, but I think we will be okay. Now, we do have a housing issue here Aggressors as well. Aggressors spotted. So I guess here we're going to build luxury residences. Hello. Mineral extraction platform you lost. Oh, good job. Hello. Great. So they came in with a small fleet, and um, they probably thought it was a big fleet, but it wasn't really. Not really. We did lose- oh man, we lost some cruisers again. But we're fine on the rest. Yeah, we're fine. So... I propose we get our ships repaired and then go in. I think that would be okay. We have- we have the time to fix them up now, because the uh, Tempest Show will not fly in soon again. And when that's done, there we go, and now you, there we go, there we go, there we go, 76k even, yeah, we're good, we're good. You need two Corvettes, we don't really care about those. I'm waiting for that battleship to finish though, 74 days and then we're going in. It's going to be exciting. Construction complete. Exciting, exciting. Okay, do we have gene clinics here? No, we do not. But we could upgrade this. That would give us housing too. So we need more minerals. No, we don't. We need one more pop. Okay. That's fine. Uh, we're losing energy still though. Cloverfield is in a bit of a pickle. Same problem, but... You're far away from 80 pops. So we might want to switch out one building for something else. Like, get rid of one of the civilian fabricators and replace that with... Luxury residences. We're losing a lot of food now. But that can be fixed with a uh, food district. Got tree beard. Okay. Are you done? Hey, hello, Bojanites. Are you coming in to help? That would be great. Okay. There we go. There we go. Ooh, there we go. There we go. Let's see what happens. Shoot everything! The game's gonna be like, I'm going to lag so hard, you don't even know what's going to happen to you. Oh yes. Oh yes. Shoot and kill, boys. Shoot to kill. Oh yes, it's going down. The gray goo is complete. going down. A lot of our ships are going down. Oh, that was it. That was fast. Our forces have succeeded in destroying the main facility of the Grey Tempest. With the neutralization of its subspace transmitter, all existing Tempest nanomachines have been rendered inert. Unable to maintain their cohesion, their ships have dissolved into nothingness. Any planets that were covered by the Tempest's Grey Goo are now home to enormous swirling dust storms consisting of nothing but disabled nanites. With time and resources, these worlds could possibly be made habitable once more. Yes! Great. Great, great, great. Hello, why are you over there? Survey. Right now. And you go there. Oh, I didn't even send in the juggernaut. Ooh, latent psionic powers have begun to manifest in certain individuals belonging to the Igarian species, according to leaked reports from authorities in the authority of Igaria. This must be a fairly recent development, since we have no record of Igarians ever displaying psionic abilities on file. According to the leaked reports, these powers are so far limited to a very small minority of the Agarian species as a whole. Scientists in the authority of Agari have offered no explanation. 
The Igarian, Igarian population within our borders have begun exhibiting similar changes as well, so whatever is happening to their species is not localized to any single region of space. Yes, we can sense it. Good! That will make us closer to each other. Wait, can't find a path home. What? Wait, where did my juggernaut go just now? I told it to go home and just went MIA. It's like, haha, I don't know where I am. What? Why? Okay, well. Gun and missile battery, you need to be as good as you can. They're fighting. Oh, Stop whoa, whoa, whoa. fighting! Close borders. Jarathian, Lethrepian, Mishar. Jarathian. You, Lethrepian. Who, who are you again? Lethrepians. Lethrepian? I have no idea. Oh, they're so. Oh, there they are. And the Mishar. We don't care about the Mishar. However, though, I got. I. Igaria. Research agreement. Look at that! That would help them. I don't care about that. That's fine. You have Federation Association status. Why can't I. Ooh, let's try and get them in here, huh? Let's try and get them in here. Form a research agreement. Let's see if we can get these guys to join our Federation. That would be great. At least I think so. We should probably improve relations if we have... We could use Franz of Grey because I don't think we'll ever get the Brubian hierarchy in here. Now. There we go. Let's see if we can get these guys to join. That would be cool. Okay, now we are looking at this here. Where are all the resources that usually are in the uh, L cluster systems? I don't get it. Where are they? Hmm. Or did they just... No, they didn't come to being. That's weird. Now we can terraform these... Um... Oh, we could consecrate this world. That'd be good for us, actually. Let's do that. This world is now consecrated. Nobody, nobody can set foot on it. As per my instructions. Now, I do need this, though. So, I don't know how much longer you're going to be taken, but I need you to finish this soon. So that we can, um... Not be beaten by the Hruni. Construction complete. Because that would be bad. Rising unemployment on Arthurium. Yeah, you don't look at it for two seconds and they're like, Nyeh. Can't build the Dyson Sphere yet. Or, or at least not here. Maybe that's the point. Dyson Sphere needs, what was it? A singular... A one-star system, and you need to get rid of the mining station there, right? I think? Is that it? I don't quite remember. I think so. I think so. Hey, what's this? X-Fan Labs. Oh, look at that! Do we have a uh, research ship in the neighborhood? Research complete. Oh, oh no, that's something else. Energy credits from jobs. Oh, look at that. We have positive energy income now. Ho ho! What? That's been a while. Come on, hurry up. Research complete. Strike craft damage. Good. Minerals from jobs. Yes. We even have positive food income. Look at that. They're already coming. The Imarza here. Yep. Increase benefits on sunlight. Come on, research finish it. complete. Finish it. Atman cap. System build. survey complete. Have to build those buildings. Outpost. Good. Okay. Go home. Go home. What's this? Production targets. 
That gave us minerals, didn't it? Yeah, but we have that other ambition here, Omnifarious Acquisition, that gives us minerals. So for now, we're okay. We could get another one activated, actually. If we wanted to. Okay. We're getting Nethris. Time to look at my planets again, I suppose. But also at this station. I need the Offworld Trading Company. And I need to upgrade this to a Citadel. I need to get the Titan Assembly Yards back. And you have a Colossal Assembly Yard. That's right. Cloverfield. Okay. Whoa, look at this. 11 unemployment. <laughs> That's the worst, isn't it? You're doing fine, Orange Tulip. You're laughing at everybody going, I don't know what your problems are, but we're fine. We are just fine. Lichen. Mm, you're not really problematic just yet. But I could upgrade you. Purpurium has a problem. It housing as well. But that's okay, you're gonna get to 80 pops and then we're gonna upgrade this thing, yeah. Orchid. <sighs> Lily. Expensive upgrades, this. Okay, Trivia for now is okay. Elodea is fine. Sunlight, you're still having trouble. Okay. We can do something with Elodea, so let's do that. Not using crystals. Because we simply don't have enough of those. Okay. Oh, this planetary management. Okay, Ibleen is fine, doesn't need Construction to be upgraded. Complete. Zarak, Prithi needs to be upgraded. Construction complete. Hodranus should probably be upgraded. Are these pirates? Yeah. Bloody cutthroats. Maya should probably be upgraded because all the systems around post catnip should be better defensible. But I also want to start building that um that mega structure. And I want to go research the situation log updated. So let's go do that. And why are you not building this? Because I didn't give you the order, that's why. But where are all the nanites and stuff? Usually that was a mineable thing. Was is, was that changed? The Hruniev closed their borders. I'm gonna close my borders on you too. And the Mishar, I need to close my borders to them as well. We're not at war with them, but them having access to Prithi is a little bit problematic. It's not pretty. <laughs> How does she come up with these things? Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. I want to move towards the endgame crisis now. I'm ready. Mentally, at least. Not not physically. I'm physically I'm very unready. Couldn't be more unready. <laughs> but mentally, I'm fine. I'm okay. Mentally, I can take it on. You're being repaired. You're gonna be okay. You didn't really lose that many ships. Well, you lost a lot of Corvettes, but that's okay. Cherry Blossom. Why are you... Why are you oh, hang on. You lost your home uh, base, didn't ya? You lost your home base. Post Catnip is your home base. Poor, poor fleets. They lost their home base. That's so sad. <laughs> Aww. Thistlewing back at 59k. Who's daring claim my territory? The Hruni. Terminal Egress. Really? They're fighting. Yeah, the, Stop fighting! The problem with me closing the Terminal Egress to them is that they can't get to their systems here. But they should have thought of that sooner. 
Now, 001 interface declared war on the Citizen Republic of Yinan. What is going on in this? This is the third machine uprising we've had in this series. That is ridiculous. Well, I guess we know what kind of uh, endgame crisis we're likely to be getting. Um, the Hruni. Let's look at you. You are inferior. Well, I don't care then. You are in the Pangalactic Coalition with the Mishar, the Threpians, and the Tarathians. The Tarathians are a problem because they're equivalent, but, 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 we, of course, also have the Urza, who are equivalent. So I do still think that we are stronger, and we are working on the authority of Agaria. Let's see if we can get them in here as well. But... I don't know if we'll be able to do that. But anyway, um, yeah, we got rid of the uh, Grey Goose. That's good. And now we can focus on the endgame crisis, whatever that may be. But it's probably going to be something synthetic, I'm afraid. Unless, unless it will have something to do with our psionic abilities. But with all the machine uprisings here, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what will happen. We'll see. We will see. And I also need to think about a Dyson Sphere somewhere. Would this be a good Dyson Sphere location? I'm actually not entirely sure. Let's check it out before I end the episode. Yeah, there we go, Machine Uprising. We have even saw it before the game told us about it. That's fantastic. Hey, I could have made you jump. Jump! Thor! Feldram! Jump it! Yeah, that was bad. Just don't do that, Thrush. Don't do it. Okay. Will you tell me if it's possible with that thing? Or am I missing something for the- Oh, maybe I'm missing Dyson Sphere tech. That's possible. That's entirely possible. Let's disband the station. There we go. Yeah, I can't build it. I do think that- I do think I'm getting the requirements right. Oh, wait. No. I do think so. Not entirely sure. But anyway, I'm going to cut the episode here. And in the next one, we'll see what happens. I have no idea. <laughs> so, uh, ooh, it's going to be a surprise. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit the like button. And please consider subscribing. It helps out immensely. New episodes in the Groomy Collective come out about every other day at 8 p.m. CET. And I will see you next time.